So a warm welcome to you all. We will be on the way very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. And our live game is Valencia against Las Palmas. I'm Peter Drury, and providing analysis and expert opinion alongside me will be Jim Becker. Well, thanks for that, Peter. I'm uh, more than ready to get going here. Lineups we've just been given. Down to business here. Mustafi. Fakuli. Doing well down the right, but he's left himself in need of support. Fakuli. Fakuli's cross. Can he put it away? Oh, good effort. He got plenty on that. Yeah, and he knew he had to get his efforts away before it had been closed down, but he could have sacrificed a little power then for a bit more accuracy. Well, that's so close to a dream start, and it could have made such a difference for what's to follow. I mean, this looks as if it could be quite an exciting game. Real chance! And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. When a high defensive line like that works, it looks very intelligent and very focused. But when it fails, it can make you look really foolish. And it's Negredo. 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 So what now? Rules out on the left now. Fakuli. Tries running with the ball at his feet. Fakuli. Whipped in. He's there to hoof it away. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Negredo! Goal! Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Now that's what I call finishing, right in the corner. He knew instinctively who was where and didn't need to waste any time weighing things up. That's a cracking goal. Valencia take the lead. Well, that's put him in the driving seat, but there's a lot of football left in this one yet, believe me. Good run down the left. What can they make of it? Who's ball? Who's going to get that? It's a very good battle there. Terrific to watch. Negredo. He'll have a go. Negredo would have known he needed to generate more power behind that, but it just lacked the precision anyway. It so nearly came off for him. Yeah, he's definitely a player who looks like he could make something happen every time he's on the ball. He's just full of belief and energy. So they got the only goal to give them a 1-0 lead. Turns and goes back. Oh, listen, I think you can understand at times that the pace of the game pressures players into split-second decisions and sometimes they just make the wrong one and I think he would have been better placing that. Well, the score's only 1-0, but that doesn't tell the full story. 
Abdenor. Mustafi. Fakuli. Aimed long and direct. Negredo looking to penetrate opposition lines. Just off target. Well, with this guy and the talent he's got, you know he's probably going to try his look from there, but that one he didn't really get right at all. There he is, making his presence felt. Well, there's no doubt that the whole team revolves around them now. He leads by example, and he's become the main pivot. Cracking player. Negredo. That is going to be the final action of the first half. Well, they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to groom with the lead at half time, and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. Valencia for the dressing room. And the action is back on the way. Valencia carry a one goal lead into the second half. Oh, he's broken through. Big chance, must be! A great save, real class. And that's a really instinctive stop, too. Great reflexes to make it happen. I thought he showed class there. Too heavy, keeper can pick that up. The Credo. Can he find a finish now? Really well taken goal. A two goal cushion, and it's looking safe. Jim, your thoughts? Look, he can only exploit the space if the pass is good enough, and in that instance, he was instinctive and quick, and it did the damage. Valencia take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Fakuli plays it into the box. A foul, yep, referee's given it. Oh, that's a booking, always looked it. Some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Now it's Rodrigo.
Parejo looks it towards the front. Chance! It's Rodrigo! They are running riot! And the lead is three! It is surely done! I think he just thought about trying his look from further out there, but why bother when you can worm your way through a defence like that? It's it's terrific play to, to get through and score. Las Palmas and the sub ready to come on. Valencia take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. That's great defensive work. It doesn't take too much imagination to guess what would have happened otherwise. Javi Fuego. He's gone out of play. a change here there's a man waiting to come on I just think that's really good management introducing one of his younger players when the pressure's totally off just allowing him some valuable easy on-field experience time Rodrigo in by Rodrigo what about it ruthless and relentless utterly rampant Urge to shoot, and he duly delivered. Faguli just knew instinctively where the ball was going to end up. That's clearly been worked on on the training ground, and the understanding is, is pretty exceptional between them, and it was beautifully worked. Valencia totally rampant here. Now it's for Cooley. Information that there will be four minutes stoppage time. Tries to get it forward quickly. For Cooley. Oh, flags up. He must have been offside. Time is up, and there goes the whistle. Valencia have won big and in style. Everything went for them. Their poor opponents left chasing shadows. A scintillating performance. So, Jim, how do you